Coming up on Eyewitness News at 5 o'clock, our icy streets created a giant headache for rush hour commuters this morning. Tonight, we'll tell you whether it looks like there may be more chaos on the roads when you wake up tomorrow morning. We'll also update you on which schools will be closed again tomorrow and which ones will finally open. Well, this new year brings a new kind of health care. This is for your pets. Our consumer reporter Sharon Summers has details. And what does the winter storm have in common with the opening of the 88th State Legislature? Well, only Leroy Powell can tell us. Good evening. I'm Jim Axel. And I'm Pam Martin. It's all coming up next on this new edition of Eyewitness News at 5. Now, TV5 Eyewitness News at 5 with Pam Martin and Jim Axel, Ken Cook's weather, and the Eyewitness News team. This is TV5 Eyewitness News at 5. Good evening, I'm Jim Axel. Tonight, Metro Atlanta is slowly emerging from last week's barrage of ice, snow, and cold wintry weather. But are we still feeling the chilling effects of last week's storm? Well, icy roads caused major problems for drivers trying to get to 